This video is about application of the first derivative, guided practice one. A company mines copper, where the mass of copper X is measured in several tons. The company's profit P measured in millions of dollars depends on the amount of a copper mined. The profit is given by the function, this one. Find the P of 0 and a P of 6 and interpret the results. So we have P of 0 equals, we plug in 0, 2.3, 0 minus 0 0.05, 0 squared minus 12 equals negative 12. The unit is a million dollars. Then P of 6 equals 2.36 minus 0 0.05, 6 squared minus 12. We put into calculator, you will get 0. The meaning for P of 0, when the company doesn't mine any copper, it will lose $12 million. When the company mines 6 tons copper for P of 6, it will earn $0. Now for B, find the dP by dx. dP by dx equals 2.3x derivative minus 0 0.05 x squared do the derivative minus 12 do the derivative so we have 2.3 minus drop down minus 1 you will get 0 0.1 x according to the definition first the derivative is the instantaneous rate of change of a function at a point therefore dp by dx it's the rate of a change of the profit with respect to the amount of a copper mined. Let's say the meaning of the first derivative again. It represents the rate of change in profit with respect to the amount of a copper mined. Now let's go to C. Find the value of a P and a DP by DX when X equals 20 and X equals 25. We will get the P of 20. Put the 20 into the original function. We get the 2.3 times 20 minus 0 0.05 times 20 squared minus 12 equals 14. P of 25 you will get the 2.3 times 25 minus 0 0.05 times 25 squared minus 12 equals 14.25. So for P prime of 20, from B, we already got uh, dp by dx equals 2.3 minus 0 0.1x. So we plug in 2.3 minus 0 0.1 times 20 equals 0 0.3. For p prime of 25, you will get the 2.3 minus 0 0.1 times 25. That's equals negative 0 0.2. Let's go to D, interpret the answers to C. We have uh, P of 20 equals 14, which means when the company mines 20 tons of copper, the profit will be $14 million. P of 25 uh, equals 14.25 means uh, when the company mines 25 tons of copper, the profit will be $14.25 million. For P prime of 20 equals 0 0.3, remember 
P prime means the rate of change. So when the company mines 20 tons copper, rate of the profit is increasing at 0 0.3 million dollars per ton of a copper mined. Since this 0 0.3 is positive, that's why it's increasing. For P prime of 25 equals negative 0 0.2, when the company mines 25 tons copper, the rate of the profit is decreasing at $0.2 million per ton of copper mined. Now let's go to E. Find the value of x for which dp by dx equal to 0. So we will set up this equal to 0. Add 0 0.1x both sides. Then you divide it by 0 0.1 both sides. You will get the x equals 23. For f, determine p for this value of x and interpret this value. So you got the p23 equals. You plug into the original function, get a 14.45. When you interpret this value, we know we set up derivative equal to zero, which means uh, we're looking for maximum or minimum. Definitely for this uh, problem, we are looking for the maximum profit of the company is uh, $14.45 million.